These were the scenes yesterday from the now former encampment behind Winco. Up here at the Winco camp, Home Depot. Everybody's uh, cleaning up, making their way out. How you guys doing? How you guys doing this morning? This footage is courtesy of Jimmy Kitchens to Bellingham Metro News. As of today, earlier this morning at 8 a.m., crews began clearing the encampment along the 4,000 block of Deemer Road in Bellingham. Quite a home you guys got up here. Huh? Said quite a home you guys got up here. The encampment had become infamous with Bellingham residents as a 15-year-old girl had died back in March from a drug overdose. How are you guys doing? It's not that great. Hey, you point that camera at me, I'll break it. I'll tell you right now. Get your fucking camera out of my fucking face, motherfucker. Get back. Bro, get you ain't got back. no right to come take pictures of none of us. Get back. Fuck you, f***. Get back. Fuck, motherfucker. Get back. They take your f***ing out of my face. I ain't filming you. You just fucking filmed me twice, dude. Get the fuck back. Get the fuck out of here. Get back. Motherfucking f***. You punk motherfucker. This ain't even your property, dude. You ain't got no right to take none of our fucking pictures, you bitch. I have every right. No, you don't. Burp and see what's going on up here, man. I just want to see what's happening. Why not? No, I get it. I get it. You guys are having a rough time. It's all good. Well, no, I'm just showing the community what's going on up here. I completely agree. I've been in your situation. It's all good. It's harassment. <laughs> okay. Camera, I'm, I'm walking fucking, right by you. You get the fuck out of here. I'm walking right by you. Go. I'm walking right fucking by you. Bitch. Fucking punk motherfucker. You too, boy. Yeah, it's illegal. Keep walking. Don't trip down the hill, boy. <laughs> fucking call blood looking motherfucker. I know they're fucking business, but harass fucking us. They ain't harassing you, dude. Yeah, you are. I told you to get the fucking camera and say five fucking times. Am I harassing you? Yeah. Man, go up to you and I'm fucking here. I'm boy. filming you on private property. Fuck you, bitch. Bro, why don't you pull your camera around next? Huh? Sad boy? Me too. I've been in this situation. Yeah, did you know how it feels? I do. Then you tell your fucking bitch you to get his fucking gear out of your face. He's got every right. You, you don't got no right. It's against the law to fucking videotape us. No, it's not. You can't do shit. The fuck it is it? No, it's not. It's fine. Get your fucking camera out of my face, bro. Seriously. The now former homeless encampment along the 4,000 block of Dima Road in Bellingham was home to between 40 and 60 people for a significant period of time. Towards the end of last year, the city of Bellingham had filed a lawsuit in the Superior Court of Whatcom County against Irwin Romel for not cleaning the encampment. The city claimed that it had caused a public nuisance, and a settlement was recently met to clear the now former encampment. Just a few days ago, signs were posted by all exits and entrances of the encampment saying, Notice, Trespass and Cleanup. You are trespassing on private property in violation of RCW 9A.52.080 and directed to vacate within 72 hours. The property owner of Dima Road will engage in a cleanup of the illegal encampment this week of May 8th through 12th of 2023. Individuals remaining on the property without permission of the property owner at 8 a.m. on May 8th, 2023 will be arrested for trespassing. All personal property left behind may be removed and discarded by the property owner. If you need assistance, please see the array of services available to you. The back of the notice.
in this aerial shot, you can see piles and piles and piles of filth, trash. There's a creek along this as well. It had just gotten to the point where it was just beyond ridiculous for this to, you know, be allowed. I don't know how it was allowed in the first place, causing an environmental hazard, you know, the needles everywhere, the garbage, the theft that was arraying and radiating to all the nearby businesses. You know, anyone who works in all these places along the Meridian business strip over here knows that all throughout the day, there's people stealing stuff and just running back into that encampment. Initial court documents in the past also stated that illegal and lethal drugs such as fentanyl have been seized on this property and an overdose death and deaths have occurred. Neighboring developments also complain that needles, tinfoil, and other drug paraphernalia are spilling over into their properties. In a small snippet of an email sent earlier this year from Lieutenant Claudia Murphy of the Bellingham Police Department, it read, I can say, however, this is not the first death in the encampment in the 4000 block of Deemer Road, where the abuse of fentanyl runs rampant along with quite a bit of other criminal activity such as theft, possession of stolen property, as well as the use and sale of drugs. There have been fires in the encampment, as well as fights, and a recovered stolen vehicle.